Over 100 volunteers reported for duty at the FAU Stadium's one and only Super Flush. A, a stadium peak flow test or a flush test. And what we were testing was we had all, a lot of volunteers, uh, FAU alumni came out and assist us. And we're everyone went around and was stationed in each restroom and we're flushing all the restrooms almost simultaneously to simulate the maximum uh, potential usage of the stadium during the game. There were 361 stalls and 100 urinals that needed to be flushed, so everybody got quite the workout. To make sure that the lift station uh, can handle the capacity and to make sure that the, all the pipes and fixtures are working correctly. And uh, it looks like the results were, were good today. We're kind of checking all of our notes. We got to fill out some sheets, but everything seemed to go very well just out of control, out of this world. We got to flush all the toilets. I was in charge of nine toilets and seven sinks. I just kept pushing those toilets down, making sure the water flushed and that it wasn't brown, because that's what you don't want. You want clear water in the bathrooms. Not only does this mean our stadium will be cleaner, but we're that much closer to the stadium being finished. Everything is tracking well and uh, gonna be open on time for October 15th, the first game. For a countdown and updates of the upcoming stadium, visit FAUsports.com. For FAU Sports Weekly, I'm Jeanette Javier.